Purdy Bob's tractor repair. Pulling the sleeves out of this 13.5 liter, the engine for the 9560RT. Just thought I'd show you, these are wet sleeves. They come out real easily right now, but they sometimes don't. Down inside there, the reason they call them a wet sleeve, if you can see, there's O-rings down in there where the bottom part of this seats on them O-rings. The orange one keeps the antifreeze away from the oil. The, obviously, the black one keeps the oil from getting in the antifreeze. Use a tool like this, pull them out. You can drive them out from the bottom. They don't come out that hard, usually. But something you really got to pay attention to is this shim. There are shims on the bottom of these sleeves, or the bottom of the head right here. And what them do is them go, they seat right down inside this ring area here. Those are to keep the, the height of the sleeve, the height of the sleeve, they're to keep it at a certain height. And you have to check that when you reassemble it. So usually what I do is I don't put the O-rings in. I take the sleeves dry, set them down in there. Then you actually have to clamp them down with a bolt in the head here, clamp the sleeve down, and then check your height. If your protruders, they call it cylinder protrusion height. If that height isn't right, you gotta adjust these shims to get it right. If not, you're gonna be really disappointed when you put it together.